Hey, yo, how y'all doing? How y'all been? Hey, yo, how y'all doing? How y'all been? Am I crooked? There they go with that noise again. There they go with that noise. Y'all know they always make that noise when I hit record. Why? Why? Why y'all do that? Anyway, it's been a long time. I should not left you. Okay. So today. This looks so bad. If look how first of all, I'm sorry to have left you guys for so long. I'm here. I'm back. I'm ready to rap. I mean do videos. <laughs> but look how my curl pattern is loosening up. Oh my gosh. I can finally put a comb through my hair without crying, okay? If I wasn't going for this, I would be mad at that these curls because they are like dead to the world. But I'm heat training, which is purposely to loosen up my curls because I don't like those super tight curls. So instead of getting a relaxer, I'm just heat training. Okay, I just wanted to say, hey, if I could chew gum while I blow dry my hair, I definitely would, but I can't. So I'll be back in a gif. Toodaloo. Okay, y'all. So I'm back. I'm back. I'm back again. I'm back. I'm back. I'm back. I'm back again. I'm back. I hope y'all can't hear that choo-choo train out there. It's just, I always move by a highway or a train. And I don't even be paying attention. I forgot to plug in my babies. I forgot to plug in my babies. I forgot to plug in my babies. Plug in my babies. My favorite flat iron in the whole wide world. In the whole wide world. In the whole wide world. I put this baby on 450, okay? Because remember, we said that we was um trying to loosen up that curl pattern, okay? Because it's too tight. If you're on the scalp, like, I'm too tight. <laughs> Um, I had to throw that on there. Now I only got, I gotta hurry up. Am I sweating? I am sweating. I ain't even did none. Oh, I have blow dry my hair with a super hot blow dryer. That's why I'm sweating. Duh. I'm not trifling. I just got out the shower. Okay. <laughs> so. Um, I'm going to pause and take a break after I, um, I don't start on that side. Do I? Well, I'm going to because the part is on that side. But yeah, and, um, in a little bit, I got to go give me and my honey something. Ow! I scratched myself. Now I'm going to have a scratch and it's going to look like I've been abused. And then when I say I scratch myself, flying my hair, ain't nobody going to believe me. But anyway, so y'all never, y'all always be yelling at me talking about I don't show the products. It's not a secret. Look, it won't show. See, it won't show. It won't. Because it's mirror like. It's Kenra Platinum Silkening Gloss, okay? So, um,. Y'all gotta get me and my honey something to eat in about uh, 10 minutes? No, 20 minutes. So I'm gonna have to come back. Where is my comb? Where is my comb? Where is my comb? Where is my comb? Can't do it without my comb. That didn't even go, but whatever. It's over here. Alrighty. So, like I said, this is on 450. Kids do not try this at home, okay? I mean, if you want to, but if you burn your hair out, don't blame me. Don't blame me. I said, don't blame me. Don't blame me. Don't blame me. Don't blame me. I'm used to, um, well, I just got used to doing my hair on 450 because it gets it super straight the way that I like it. You know, 
That's the way, uh-huh, uh-huh, I like it. Uh-huh, uh-huh. That's the way, uh-huh, uh-huh, I like it. Now when I burn myself. Oh, Jesus. Ooh. Ooh. I remember when I was little, I used to get my hair pressed. And she used to burn my ear. And I used to, in my head, I used to be like, oh, if she burned my ear one more time, I'm going to call her the B-word. <laughs> I was like, how old was I? Freaking um, 10. Trying to cuss. No one I ain't cuss. But she deserved it for burning my, burning my ear like that. What's wrong with that lady? Shoot. Or when they burn your scalp, especially when they start using these flat irons. Like, yo, why are you so close to my scalp though? Like, you gotta burn me? I don't understand why you gotta burn me. But please keep in mind, I think 450 is the burning point for the hair. So don't be talking to me about, oh, the temperature's too high. I know what I'm doing, okay? I know exactly what I'm doing. And if I just so happen to burn my hair out, then I just so happen to burn my hair off. But I won't, because I've been doing this since forever. Well, I haven't been flat ironing my hair since, I mean, at 450 since forever. I just started when I started the um, heat training process. I wonder, can y'all see that smoke? Can you see the smoke? So where have I been? I've been here, I've been there, I've been all over the world. I wish. I had to take a little hiatus because a few of y'all was driving me crazy in the comments and I wanted to cuss you clean out but I said you know what the Lord is my shepherd I shall not want so I just decided to take a little break take a little break to, 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 to take a little break so while I was gone I just worked shipped which I am absolutely in love with shipped. If you need extra money, I mean, I know I used to talk about Instacart. Man, ship wasn't bumping like that. I forgot to bring my mirror. So y'all are my mirror right now. But uh, ship wasn't bumping like that. I hadn't done shipped in like eight months or so. So my cousin called me. She lived in Toledo. She was like, girl. Instacart, you better get on that ship. It's money in them ship streets. Over, over. Like, so I've been making some pretty decent money. Because, see, the thing with ship is they have um, designated times that they want people's stuff delivered, right? So, if, um, the time is fast approaching, like say something to do from four to five. Between four and five, they want to drop off and nobody has picked up the order to shop it. And it's 3.30 or 3.45, they're going to start adding money to that order for somebody to grab it. So like I can have, it can be like a 10 item order. First, it'll start out at like 10, between 10 to 15 dollars, and that's the range it'll give you on the thing. And then, if nobody get it by like 30 minutes after the hour, then they'll start raising it 21 to 23 dollars in um, that hour. You'll earn between 21 and 23 dollars. Don't nobody get it, it'll go up 25 or 27. All the while, it's still only like eight items that you gotta shop. So, I'm, I can run into Meyer and only have to get eight things and I'm making $27 and then ship customers is different them ship customers oh they gonna tip you baby they gonna tip you like 
my lowest tip was like five dollars highest tip was 27 so one order i had gotten um are we static in today i know we ain't static in today i washed you right and i blow dried you right don't start with me do not start yeah so i had ended up getting an order for like a few items and it had went to promo that's what it's called promo like when you're trying to get people to um get to do the order for the delivery time to make the delivery time so that's usually all i do is promo orders because they cost they the most money you gonna get so um when i did the one order it was like a 30 dollar order for a few items then they turned around and gave me um a 22 dollar tip so i came out with 50 some dollars just for picking up a few items and dropping them off at their house and it wasn't even that far from the store okay then okay then oh oh okay then okay then okay then oh oh happy <laughs> so yeah and like i used to hate maya right because on instacart Meyer does not have the aisle numbers but on ship they got the aisle number the section number and i don't know what that last number is but the aisle number and the section number are enough to get you where you need to get the item so so um now that i'm learning um Meyer like that boy i'll be up in here like supermarket sweep okay give me my 50 dollars give me my 25 dollars like if i put in a decent amount of um time i can make i remember the one i think it was the holiday i made five hundred dollars in two days you heard me two days now i don't know who gonna pay all these taxes <laughs> on this money when it comes <laughs> no, i'm just playing i'll have to figure it out but you definitely have to save up for the taxes though okay that's flowing like i want i want to be known as the nice lady who i want to be nice lady that's who i want to be the nice lady do y'all think my hair is growing i think it is excuse these underarm pit spots i mean i'm working with heat here what do you want from me my 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 blow dryer was blazing hot my flat iron is 450 degrees i mean if you don't sway you're not normal right hopefully i'm still crew am i still crew not that side profile i can't stand that stuff Oosh. see stop talking so much <laughs> oh y'all guess what i finally made it to florida again my favorite place before they ban us from traveling i finally made it and it was an adventure like a straight up adventure i'm gonna do um gum chewing uh story time probably the next one that's my plan that is my plan but y'all so i really i'm gonna have to start changing the way i fly because my hair is growing so I can't be stretching all the way down here and I need to be over here because it's going long, 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 long. <laughs> but I'm really struggling, right? So, you know, with the kids being online and school and stuff. First, my son was doing like K-12. I was like, oh no, this is way too much work. I had to help him like so much and I wasn't able to work. 
So I switched them back to his other school. What do they have? A mastery curriculum, which basically you got to master the subject before you can move on. And it's more independent. Ow, crap. So I just said I got to change the way I do this and I'm still doing it the same way. But anyway, so yeah, I have to, um, <clears throat> he's struggling with the mastery, um, curriculum because it was fine when he was in school and he had this teacher that was helping him but now they're no longer in school and the teacher isn't even there so I th i'm pretty sure i told y'all about the teacher that was making me angry with the report and stuff because i was so angry i was telling everybody <laughs> but yeah um if i burn myself i'm gonna be mad because i ain't never did it from this way but yeah so uh she i mean he needed help and like i just felt like he wasn't getting the help that he needed and i'm paying for the school every month his dad and i and so i'm like oh my gosh I gotta find him another school so i'm like well since they're all online and honestly the only reason he was in um private school is so that he wasn't in public school with the bad kids so i put him into public school but you know they're online so um, it's fine so today was his first day online ah! and he's um doing classes and stuff and then he has music class and they're, they're learning this song that i do not approve of and it's by an artist that heavily influences young people and she even sings about suicide and everything. And it's like, I'm not exactly sure what the song is. All I know is that I'm familiar with the artist and I don't agree with the artist. And so I'm like, I don't want my son singing any of her music. Like, no. And people don't understand how powerful music is. It's very powerful. But, um, so I'm like, dang it, now what do I do? You know? So now I'm trying to figure out what to do. I really wish I could homeschool him, but when I tell you I'm not a teacher, and I, I know things, but I don't know how to teach things. Like, I don't want my son to be stupid because I can't teach him. I don't know. But I'm like, this music class is not gonna cut it because I'm not, he's, he's not learning that song. I don't approve that music in my home and it's not even for kids at all so I don't even know what this teacher is thinking but I mean people would do different things in their homes which is fine but in my home my son don't listen to any and everything I don't need him being influenced by certain things in my home now if you run out and sneak and do things on your own and that's different but in my home we have standards and we don't take in any and everything so I'm just unsure of what to do anybody out there homeschool like real life homeschool have your own curriculum or not associated with the public school system I don't know guys I'm just lost and I don't know what to do can't wait till I'm like Right here like ooh girl your hair is so long ooh girl <coughs> the smoke is getting me I really should open the window because my honey come in here like ooh is it a beauty salon in here what's going on I really want to finish this side before I gotta leave my food but time is ticking and you playing girl you playing you playing, girl? You playing? I'm trying. I can't believe I left y'all for a month. I'm so sorry. It probably was a little longer than that. I don't even know what we talked about last. Oh, that other flat iron that I cleaned off? It, um, it did not. I don't think it stayed hot. I'm like, oh, so this is why you gave it to the thrift store? You disrespectful disloyal you just threw that stuff in the trash 
Why did I say trash doctor? Mm -hmm. I want to see my cousin's baby. He's only six months here. Six months. He has the prettiest eyes in the world. They're like gray. Then they look like dark blue. I'm like, are you an alien? Where did you come from, little baby? Because no one in our family has has hair. I mean, eyes like this. My son is like, I think um, she needs me to move in to help me take care of the baby. <laughs> I'm like, does she? Oh, so I've been working out. Not as much as I should, but I have been sticking to it. Now it's just a matter of changing the crap that I eat. No, that's that's what it is. Changing that diet. Cause I want some abs, abs and abs, abs and abs and abs, abs and it. Y'all know what I'm saying? Abs and you know what else I want. <laughs> Man, I'm getting hotter and hotter. I hope y'all can hear this chewing. I'm trying to chew like a horse. My um my gum. Sorry I didn't use my camera today. Could you tell? I wanted to use I didn't feel like um because I need a new SD card. <clears throat> I have videos on there that I still haven't. Um, put up so uh, I'm gonna have to go I'll be back to do the other side, okay? I wish I could go faster, but I'm a slow poke. I'll be back after I get me and my honey some food, okay? Ta ta. Okay, I'm back, y'all. I'm back, y'all. I'm back at the back, and I'm back, y'all. I know I'm sweating even more than I was before. I'm sweating even more than I was before, but I don't stink still fresh it's just that these flat irons is hot and I keep nicking my scalp nick nicking my scalp <sighs> I'm trying to hurry up because this video is already long enough or already long enough already long enough uh-uh already long enough so I didn't end up leaving to go get the food because my honey wants Mexican again. I'm pretty sure in the last, since we found this Mexican restaurant, which was probably like September or something, since we found them, I'm sure we've given them a good $300 of our money. And to me, to me, that's absolutely ridiculous. And I don't understand why we've given them so much of our money. Oh, so I made some banging food um, on December 21st. 
is my son my bonus son I don't like saying that but I don't like to say stepson either birthday he was six he turned 16 y'all know I ain't got no damn 16 year old not I <laughs> not one that I birthed dang that looks so trifling I want to change my shirt I think I'm about to change my shirt but anyway yeah so for his birthday he wanted um a soul food come and get your soul food I need to get different songs I feel like I'm I sing the same songs over and over all around the world same song I feel like I sing the same so I gotta get another shirt because I ain't understand that Okay. Anybody else would have probably been changed their shirt like, oh my gosh, it's so embarrassing. I'm sweating on camera. You gotta talk about me. You think I care? If a bald head have to talk about me. You think I care? No, I don't, cause she ain't got no hair. No. <laughs> I'm just playing it has nothing to do with nothing. But I am going to change this shirt because I'm tired of looking at it. Just a little raggedy shirt. Just a little raggedy shirt. Shirt. I'm going to hurry up because I got to do my booty sprouts. Did I tell y'all I got a booty sprout? Do y'all even know what that is? I mean, I don't be wanting to promote people. I mean, but it's a... Um, hip thrust machine not a machine but it has like these resistance bands it's this bar that you can lean against lean your back against and then the um hip thrust machine I mean the resistance bands go across your um pelvis so instead of using barbell or something like that it's just an all-in-one so the hip thrust machine I try to do a hundred a day some days I forget or some days I, um, I'm too busy to get to it so like right now I'm really trying to hurry up so that I can um Get, this, get these booty sprouts in because I'm trying to make that booty sprout no I'm actually just trying to get stronger so that I'm physically prepared for things to come so So, so upset about, um, I really miss going to church, like, really. I'm just getting cute, going to church, praising the Lord, hearing the word, I really miss it, but this is our life. We're never going back to normal, so I just wish... I mean, we would have known our last Sunday was our last Sunday, you know. <clears throat> but when I get to heaven, it'll be like church all day. No, <laughs> I don't know. Mm -mm -mm. This hair is getting straight. Do y'all see that laugh? Oh. Do y'all see that length? It's, it seems like it's taking so long, y'all. Like, hurry up. I got things to do.
All right, I'll be right back. Gosh, finally, finally, finally to the last side. It's like, ugh, ow. And it still just seems like so much. Finally. Finally, it was happened to me right in front of my face. And I just could not hide it. I know some of y'all youngsters be like, what is she saying? What is she saying? Okay. Okay, so like I was saying, I think I had made him some, um, he said he wanted soul food. And I was like, dude, you know I'm not eating sugar. You tripping for real. But of course I gave the baby what he want, wanted. And I broke my, it was two months, my two months sugar free streak. So because I had made macaroni and cheese, banging, collard greens, banging, homemade cornbread, banging. Um, what else did I make? <coughs> Oven fried chicken, extra banging, uh, sweet potatoes, banging. But that's why I had to break my streak while well, sugar free because of them damn sweet potatoes. That was good though. But then come around. Uh, I didn't even eat much. I think I had I had sugary drinks in Florida. Which I do when I do my sugar thing right now, it's basically just keeping me away from cakes and pies and stuff. But um did I have I think I had a piece of a donut. Oh, I made him a I didn't, uh, um, dang, I can't even get it out. I made him a red velvet cake, but I didn't use the dye. Cause I'm like, why am I gonna put this dye in my kid's body? Like, press stupid. So, and actually, I didn't like the recipe that I followed. Which I've used it before. And actually I think it's because of the coffee. Cause I call for a half a cup of coffee, but I don't really know how to make coffee. So we have a Keurig, but my honey, for some reason, got the fine ground coffee. And so, did I not use the comb that I just used? Hmm. I think I skipped it, but where did the comb just go? No. Oh, all the way back there. So yeah, um, he bought the fine ground coffee. And I really don't know how to make coffee. I thought you just put it in the thing and, um, you know, it come out right. But I feel like it was so overpowering. Because the last time I made that recipe, I went to McDonald's to buy a cup of coffee. Because that's what the girl said do. And it was banging. But this time it was just like overpowering of coffee. And then even though I... um did my pan, grease my pan, and put parchment paper down. I don't think my parchment paper was big enough. Cause it's straight stuck to the dang on pan, like a, the edges. I was so mad, I'm like, but see, that's what happens when you take two months from baking, cause you're trying to stay off that sugar. And um, you ain't baking a long time. So I'm out of practice. Just as I didn't put this piece of hair in there. So, but I made the cream cheese frosting. That was banging. I mean, it was still good. It just wasn't like my best. You know what I'm saying? I told him I'm going to do my do over, but I don't know. But when I tell you that food was amazing, like it was so good that my friend was like, she used to tell me all the time. Girl, why do you throw your leftovers away? Like after 
Okay, but the next day when you eat the leftovers, if you're not going to keep eating them, just put them in a the freezer. So I was like, oh, that's kind of weird. I've never done that. But I was like, man, this food's so good. And we about to go out of town. So I just was like, I'm going to go ahead and um, throw this in the freezer. And when I tell you I came back, took that food out the freezer, it was like a week later. I just took it out the freezer um, this past weekend. When I tell you that food tastes just like the dang on day that I made that food. Girl, that food was amazing. I'm confused why you so fly away right now, but it's cool because I'm going to wrap you up and we're going to be all right. I'm really tired of doing this. I wish I had somebody to do this for me. But if I don't take care of my hair, who will? My afro gone, y'all. I don't think I can get the afro back if I try. Thought I was about to burn myself. Oh, so my birthday passed. Um. How do the people that's supposed to love you that know you going sugar free for your birthday go and buy you a cake? And I, you know what? I was so strong. I didn't touch one slice of that cake. And that's so crazy since I did it. Since I went sugar free, it's like I don't even want the sugar anymore. Ain't that crazy? Like, I'll be feeling guilty if I eat something with sugar in it. I don't even want nothing. Like, I don't even buy cookies no more. Nothing. A part of me be like, girl, why are you depriving yourself? But then, you know, another part of me is like, that's poison. Why do you want to put it in your body? I'm almost done. I'm almost done. Well, I'm not almost done because I still got to go back through. Don't put your phone on airplane mode. Everybody gets a call in you and disturbing you. She, she, she trying to grow. Whoa. Okay, now I gotta go back through. Cause I'm gonna curl it. And then I'm gonna, um, I was about to say type it. <laughs> Curl it and wrap it. That's all I'm doing. And then we're going to bed. Oh, we ain't going to bed. We're waiting for our Mexican food. <laughs> After we do our booty spells, remember? After our booty spells. Oh my honey, I promise you're going to be like, 
And why is it so smoky in here? I gotta open the window when I get done. Why y'all let me do my hair without opening the window? I mean, y'all ain't know my kind of friends. You should have told me, Nina, you see all that smoke? Let some of that slip out. Girl, what's wrong with you? As I'm in here choking. I'm trying to hurry up. I'm trying to hurry up. I don't like how this did that, but it's going to be fine once I um wrap it. It'll be a okay. Trust me. Trust me, girl. Trust me. mean to do that. So I have some jewelry and I think it's making me feel sick. Like at first I thought I was only allergic to um fake jewelry but my honey bought me some earrings. They were 14 can go and yeah. They really made me feel sick. So I'm like, it's like everything is, is irritating me now. I'm like right after I turned 36. I mean right before that, 35. Like everything. Like earlier I was like around a candle or some air freshener. It's like like my throat felt like it was swelling up. I was coughing. Oh my jeez, Louise. I can't do nothing. Everything makes me feel sick. And then, like when I went to Florida, I tried again to do some braids. My friend told me about some hair that was supposed to be hypoallergenic. It wasn't going to kill me. It wasn't going to make my throat swell up. So, it's supposed to be rinsed in apple cider vinegar. But you know that's what they say. Keeps you from having an allergic reaction, I guess. Because it removes the chemicals. So, I got it. Spent my money on it. And of course, what happened? I didn't even put it in my hair. I just wrapped it like it was like a cold day, so I put um I put the ponytail like around my neck and zipped up the um my coat and walked around with it for like two hours. At first I was fine, like the first hour I'm like, oh yeah, oh yeah, I'm about to get some hair, oh yeah, oh yeah. And then two hours into it. I'm starting to feel like I can't feel myself swallow. And then I started feeling all sick. And I was like, mm, I can't even do this. Can't even risk my life. It's so annoying though, because sometimes I just want to braid my hair and not deal with it. But I can't do that. But I just braided up my my own hair 
So I did four braids, like kind of slanted part into the back. And then I didn't think I was gonna have no hang time because I just braided it. I, did I straighten it that time? I think I did. So I had a bit of hang time. So I just curled it. I mean, I put mousse on it and it like curled up. So it was like a little curly ponytail at the bottom. I was like, I mean, at least the Lord gave me, blessed me with some hair. So <clears throat> now I'm gonna risk my life trying to, you know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? I don't gotta risk my life trying to have some braids. And as I keep taking care of it, it'll keep growing. You know. So I'm done with that fake hair. I'm not even gonna try no more. I'll just be straightening my hair. And when I get bored, or don't feel like dealing with it, then I'll just, um, what's it called it? I'll just, um, what will I do with it, y'all? Braid it. <laughs> Put my little kindergartner braids in. What else will I do? This is what you get. I ain't gonna do no little curls because I'm just about to straight put, put my wrap on and go to bed. All right, guys, thank you for tuning in. Sorry I've been gone so long. Remember to smile because you're beautiful. Remember to love yourself because if you don't love yourself, why would anyone else? Until next time, whenever that is, no, I'm just playing. Bye.